Hello everybody, we're back once again, finally, and before we get started with the video, I of course need to plug the new channel, and this is it, Rogamp2, uploading a ton of videos, well, relatively, so if you see anything you like here, just check out any of the links that you'll see either on the video or in the description, because I'm definitely going to bug you about it. So. What we're doing today is testing a, well, not really new ransomware, sort of new. It's 2015, so I guess you could call that new. This is pretty much a kind of a clone of CryptoLocker, except um, it's actually pretty easy to get rid of. So right now we're just going to download some JPEGs and we'll see if it actually can encrypt them. So save some images here. Save image. No, don't replace it. Come on. That, that'll work. View image. Save image. There we go. One more. Sweet. Okay. So now we have some images saved. Now hopefully this ransomware, which is called PC Lock, or I like to call it P-Clock. Hopefully it will encrypt everything. I actually tried to run this just a few minutes ago on a real computer with Windows 8.1, and it did not work at all. So it's just typical Windows 8.1 not working for me ever. I don't know why I even bother trying to use it. So right now it's idling, and it should start up here momentarily. Make this bigger. There we go. Okay, so it ended the process, deleted the file. It should pop up. Okay, so we have wincl.exe here. This is the main executable of PC lock. And it should start doing something here in a minute. It's actually worked earlier, and for whatever reason, it didn't care about you know vert or VMware. But for some reason, a real computer just could not run. Oh, it's doing something. Oh shit! Oh god! What happened? Personal files are encrypted by CryptoLocker, but it's actually not CryptoLocker. And it appears our files are okay. Oh no, they're not. They're they are encrypted. Oh, where'd Snoop go? Snoop, Snoop, where are you at? Damn. Let's let's show the files. So it encrypted our images, and it wants us to pay only one Bitcoin, which is actually lower than CryptoLocker, I believe. And of course, let's look at the stock ticker. It says right now at this moment, Bitcoin is at $209.15. So that's the fee that they want you to pay. And to pay, you can go to any of these websites and register and buy Bitcoin. But thankfully, you don't have to do that because there's actually a fairly good decryption tool from MSSoft. Fabian Wosar wrote this nice little tool. I haven't used it yet, but I assume it works. So... Fairly easy to get rid of. I'll put a link to this in the description as well, if you happen to have PC lock. Okay, so you run it, then it tells you there's no warranty. MSYSoft has detected files that are encrypted by PC lock, and you can just decrypt like that. And it appears to have given me my files back. Very nice, they're all here. Great. That is excellent. And it also makes a backup of the encrypted files in case if it breaks or something. So, <laughs> yeah, that was pretty quick, right? So, that is pretty much it for PC lock. It's fairly easy to get rid of. And, you know, actually, one more thing before we finish the video. There, there is some function in this that begs you to um, 
Well, it tells you that you need to pay within 72 hours, but if you don't pay, it'll beg you to like re-download the program or something. So I'm going to test that now. Give me just a minute to reset the VM. Okay, we're back and we have rerun the CryptoLocker program and it's kind of interesting that we don't have any files for it to encrypt. So when you click show files, um, it didn't actually make a encrypted files list. So yeah, it's going to ask you for money anyway, even if it didn't encrypt anything. So we're going to go ahead and just try to advance the clock a bit here. And we'll bring it back an hour and then we'll advance it to the 19th. Okay, okay. Oh god, 58 minutes. Oh shit. Let's advance it even more. Uh, this can go back to 18 and this can go to 10. Go! Oh fuck, time expired. Oh no. Time expired. Crypto Locker has rem been removed from your computer. Now you have the last chance to decrypt your files. Download and install manually Crypto Locker from the link. At this point, you have three more days to do it. Oh god, second chance. Well, last chance, according to this thing. And the file's gone forever, so you're screwed, unfortunately. So time is critical with this new crypto, well, not really Crypto Locker variant, but ransomware that uses the name CryptoLocker that is not the original CryptoLocker, also known as PC Lock. So you need to hurry up. Oh yeah, that's right. You can just use that little decryptor program, which doesn't require any of this. So again, very easy to resolve the problem. The decryptor program also deletes the CryptoLocker executable and you can just manually change your wallpaper back, I believe. Yeah, so that is about it for PC Lock. Thank you all very much for watching and take care.